government offices in the early morning are in the possession of Mrs. Mock. In hundreds, the indispensable ladies are hard at it, making the places pick and span for the vast armies of civil servants who spend the day there. Huge greats do what they can to use the nation's coal surplus, while at the Admiralty, Nelson turns a blind eye on everything from mops to missiles. They have a hard life, these women, most of them looking after a home when their morning work's done. So why not have some fun? At Clapper Manor swimming bars, they really let themselves go. 800 Mrs. Mops had a ball of their own. They each paid four and six. The rest of the cost was borne by the civil service unit. They couldn't have enjoyed it more if there'd been 800 men there, too. Most of them are Londoners. A few came from the home counties, one or two from as far off as Bath, where the Admiralty has an office. A great time for all. And they were back at work next morning. <laughs>